Welcome to the first of a series of videos on chord shapes for beginner ukulele players. This episode introduces you to three kinds of chords. We have the Z chord, the no finger chord, and one finger chords. So we're going to start with the Z chord. The Z chord was coined a name coined by James Hill, and it is the chord that is never wrong. If you're playing in a group and you get lost, you play the Z chord. So long as you keep strumming, nobody will ever know. The Z chord is simply taking your left hand and muting lightly the strings. Just very gently covering the strings. That's the Z chord. There is no discernible pitch. So it certainly can be used as a percussive technique. It can also be used when you're lost. All right, so that's the first one. There are two open chords in basic ukulele theory. They're both the same shape though. Open strings, so we have G, C, E, A, and I'm using a C6 tuned high G ukulele. The names of these two chords are A minor seven and C6. It is the same chord enharmonically. In other words, it sounds the same, but it has a different name. It depends on the context of the music as to whether it's an A minor seven or a C6. This series of videos doesn't go into music theory as to why that might be the case. It just gives you the names of these chords. So there are two open chords, A minor seven, C6. One finger chords. All right, we're gonna start with our first finger, our index finger, and we're gonna put it on the first fret of the first string. That chord is C7. Now, I don't encourage you to open your hand up like I'm doing here. I encourage you to keep your hand above the strings like that. So your other fingers are ready to play, play on the frets that they, they need to play on. I'm gonna hold it back a little bit so you can see the finger that I'm playing with though. So there's our C7. Let's go to the second, second string, same fret. That's F add nine. Let's keep going. Third string, first fret, is A7. So they're the first three common one finger chords on this first fret. Let's see what else we can do on some other frets. Let's take our first string, instead of using our first finger, let's use our second finger on the second fret, and we get a C major seven. If I come all the way across to the fourth string and play the second fret with my second finger, I have a minor. Now what about if we go to the third fret? So let's use our third finger on the third fret of the first string. We have a C chord. Now we can play that C chord also up on the seventh fret. Or on the tenth fret. And so on, all the way up to 15. Okay, so they're the open and one finger chords for beginner ukulele players. There are heaps of chords available to ukulele players, but we're gonna start with the easy, easiest chords of all for ukulele players who are beginners. Stay tuned for the rest of the episodes where we'll have a look at two finger chords and three finger chords. All right, have fun practicing. See you next time, bye now.